in this video we are going to clarify the concept of uh, java output uh, through a short java demo program uh, here uh, i am going to tell you a little bit detail about the system.out.println function that we have already used in our previous video to print something on screen so first of all uh, pre system.out.print function has two flavor the first one is just system.out.print which will print some kind of uh, message on the screen so uh, first let me start with a simple demo uh, i just want to print a simple message on screen and that's it so for that so let's say the message is uh, a message so this one i want to print a message on screen so how can i do that so i can use system dot out dot print and then a message inside double quote i have to print a message and then a semicolon so now if i just uh, run it as uh, you will see that uh, a message have been printed in the output window so that is one flavor now if i let's say uh, i want to put a line break after this message what i am saying is uh, this simple demo will clarify this concept so let us do like system dot out dot print i am doing another print message so let's say this is my second message and now if i just run it you will see that both the messages are printed on the same line so let's say now what i want is instead of printing both the message in the same line i want to print them in a different line so in order to print them in a different line there are a couple of options the first option is uh, if wherever you want to put a line break you can use this thing uh, this escape sequence so this backslash n this is called an escape sequence uh, which is the which has a special meaning in java and this backslash n stands for new line that is it will automatically put a line break after this message so let us run it and let's see what is the output so if i just run this program as you can see now after a message a line break have been put and uh, so in the second in one line you can see a message that is the part before this uh, backslash n then a new line that is a line break and after that the second message have been printed now there is another option you can use actually system dot out dot print ln this ln all ln stands for a line break in that in this way also you can put a line break in java so if you just run it as you can see the amount of space have been increased in between so one line break have been posed because of this print ln and another line break have been posed because of this backslash n so you can use either of these things uh, to put a new line or put a line break in your message so i have i am just going to use this system dot out dot print and then followed by this backslash n now uh, if you want to print a custom message you have to enclose that message string or the message text inside double quote but what about printing a variable if you want to print a variable you really do not need to use this uh, type of double quote so let me show you a demo so let's say i have a integer variable 
called a and its value is uh, let's say 20 and then i have a variable called uh, double let's say b whose value is 30.5643 something like this so i have just chosen some arbitrary numbers now uh, if i want to print them let's say system dot out dot print then if I want to print them, uh, print the value, then I can just use A. So this system.out.print will print the value of A. So let us see whether it is printing the value or not. So whenever I will run it, this program is going to print first a message, then it will print a second message, and after that, it will print the value of a so let's see whether the output is expected output or not so yes it has printed everything as expected so there is a message then a second message for these two lines of codes and after that 20 have been printed now well uh, since this is a normal print uh, there is no line break between this uh, this uh, print and this uh, message the value of a and uh, the second message so if you want to put a line break in between you can use another backslash n after this uh, second message and then you can run this program and as you can see now 20 is in a different line from the second message now the same way you can print uh, the value of uh, Let's say uh, this uh, double system dot out dot print then b uh, that should print the value of uh, b in here. So as you can see, the value of b have been printed, but this time also this time uh, again because I did not use this backslash in, uh, I have. Uh, everything have been printed in the same line so now the question is uh, is it possible to print two variable in a nice fashion like uh, one variable then one new line or one variable then a space and then another variable something like that how to customize the printing does java support all these things like uh, printing some custom message then a variable name then another variable name uh, something like that so let us see a more involved uh, example so now let us go for the next print statement where so this one is to print the value of variables on screen on screen so the next thing that we are going to discuss is just like print both a custom message and a variable together on screen together with a single system dot out dot print function so is it possible in java so let us see how to do that of course it is possible so let us see how to do that so what i want to print is like let's say i want to print the value of a equals 20 then there will be let's say a comma and then there will be a space then i want to print the value of variable or let's say instead of comma there will be a new line in the second line there will be another printing like there will the value of variable b equals 30.5643 uh, 30 so how can i do that i want to print this format this fashion so ignore these uh, 
slashes uh, uh, because these are used for comment lines actually the way i want to print it should look like this the value of a equals 20 that will be in one line then in the second line there will be like the value of b equals 30.5643 so how can i do that this entire thing using a single print statement so let me comment out these lines and let me focus on the writing the code so first of course system dot out dot print ln and now inside this parenthesis what you need to do is first you have to write down the custom message that is the value of a equals so the value of a equals that's the custom message now remember the plus operator in java as we have discussed this plus operator can be used to concatenate two different things so when you will use this plus operator uh, inside this uh, println statement with a custom message uh, that will concatenate all the things together so what does that mean let me show you a simple start with a simple example so the value of a equals then a plus symbol and after that the value of a means just a because in order to print the value of a variable we really do not need any uh, any uh, quotation symbol so the custom message is in quotation symbol and but the value is not inside so let us run this program and let's see what happened here and in order for a tidy output uh, let me just comment out all the other print statements so that you can just focus on only this part so let me run this program and as you can see it has printed the value of a equals 20 so the value of a inside this double quotation symbol is the custom message and then i have used plus in order to concatenate in order to append the value of variable a inside so this is how you can concatenate multiple output together in a single system.out.print statement and here uh, you can use a uh, I'm going to use just print statement also that is possible so now next part is uh, let's say if I want to now the next part is uh, like I have to print the value of variable b equals 30.5643 in the next line so what can I do so the first thing that I need to do is I have to put a backslash in because with a plus symbol what does this mean that means after printing this variable the value of variable a it is appending a new line or a line break so this line will put a line break and after that you can start writing this message so for example comment Control C and so if I am just copy pasting this variable B equals this is another custom message and then plus symbol then B. So I am printing the val value of the variable B and now let us see whether it print everything in different lines or not. So if I just run this program as you will see everything will be printed in a different line so in the first line there is the value of a equals 20 this is coming from this part of the code then this line break have been printed because of this line like this backslash n and after that the value of variable b equals 30.5643 that is coming from this part of the program now it is always a good idea to uh, when you will write this uh, compound uh, uh, print statement everything together 
you can just break it down to different line uh, just for the sake of simplicity for your understanding so let's say this uh, value of a equals uh, a then plus and then let's say i'm just hitting an enter just to show that well there is a line break and after that i have uh, printed everything like in here so this is just for easy readability of your program you can uh, do it in the same line or you can use a different uh, line of code so the output will be same as before so this is how using this uh, plus symbol you can concatenate multiple things together some custom message some value of variable uh, a line break all these things so this is all about the system.out.print function in java which you can use for printing many different things